Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. It is all about what I eat in a week as a junior in high school. If you're new to my channel, I'm Katie. I have a lot of new subscribers, which is very exciting. So if you don't already, be sure to go follow me on Instagram. Thank you all for subscribing. Normally my videos are very like vlog style, casual, a little bit of editing, but this one is different because it's a voiceover. I recorded everything that I ate last week to give you recipe ideas, examples of a balanced diet. I try to eat balanced. I'm not a dietitian. I'm not like a nutritionist or anything like that, but I try to fuel my body with good healthy things so that I feel good and can be my best on a daily basis so obviously like I love dessert I love to snack all that stuff and I don't eat as healthy on the weekend but during the week at least I try to stay on track with being healthy and just eating a good balanced diet so a couple things I want to mention before I get into this video first thing is that this video is a little bit scattered obviously not as long as my usual videos also, I was importing my footage and I realized that for some reason every single night I never recorded this I drink like a little tea before bed every single night either the peach tea from Tiavana or the well-rested Trader Joe's tea It's so good. I joke that it's like my bottle before I go to bed because it helps me fall asleep It's like a warm drink and it's so satisfying at the end of the day So I have those usually every night and I also have these vitamins every morning from the brand Rare Ray I don't know if I'm getting it right and I think that's everything that I have to preface I just wanted to make sure I didn't explain exclude those things that are very important that I have every single day because I didn't film them every day I also didn't film a couple snacks I had I'm sure like there were things I ate that I forgot to film but for the most part this was everything so hope you guys enjoy this video if you do please give it a thumbs up and I will see you at the end all right Monday morning of course I had school so I woke up and made this maple and brown sugar oatmeal from Kodiak cakes it has pea protein in it so that's where it gets its protein from so it's plant-based it's so good I put that in the microwave and I also chopped up a bunch of strawberries to put on top and of course, I added brown sugar and it was delicious and I ate the vitamins I was talking about at the beginning of the video, took those with water, and then it was lunchtime. So I got back from school and ate this chicken Caesar salad from Trader Joe's. I put all the toppings on it. I love their dressing. I don't use the whole packet, but I love it. So I give a pretty hefty amount and I also added craisins, just regular ocean spray brand and I shook up the whole thing. I'm a big Trader Joe's fan so this is a very common lunch for me. I love this salad and I had apples and water with it. Stay hydrated. It was phenomenal. Then I was getting hungry when I was doing my homework so I had a crap ton of these skinny dipped almonds. They are almonds dipped in chocolate obviously but it's like a thinner layer so they're a little bit healthier monday night i had dinner with my friend kenna we picked up blaze pizza and ate it on this cliff that overlooked the ocean we watched the sunset it was so beautiful i pretty much ate that entire pizza and then we went to this ice cream shop and i got a chocolate dipped banana and she got a chocolate covered ice cream thing and i got brownie bites and sprinkles on top of mine it was heavenly that was it for monday next morning it was 6 a.m i had cheer practice so i was not about to like make some sort of fancy breakfast i just grabbed one of these bars and ate it in the car of course took my vitamins these bars are the best thing ever i eat them for breakfast all the time and i also had a glass of this fruit juice blend from trader joe's once again they should be paying me for all the promo i'm doing for them in this video i had to stay at school for lunch on tuesday so i packed a lunch i had a that's it bar there's mckaylee shaking her salad i also had seaweed a whole bunch of these baby carrots and a sandwich it does not look appetizing in that clip but i had turkey cheese and unfortunately no lettuce because we were all out next up quite possibly the highlight of my week i was over at grace's and we made these pumpkin pillsbury cookies if you guys have not had these you need to like enlighten yourself and go eat them they are the best thing ever they remind me of christmas and the holidays and i ate way too many of those and i got home and my mom made this chicken teriyaki with broccoli for me and my sister ali it was chef's kiss so good i ate it around six o'clock and reba wanted some too she's coming up in the next clip there she is she was jealous <laughs> the next morning i was in the biggest rush of my life i think i just like woke up late or something i honestly don't remember but i ate another go macro bar and i grabbed these rice crunch rollers from costco to eat at school as a snack because i knew i would be hungry i also ate some grapes with that and then of course i forgot to film my lunch i went and got an acai bowl it was 
incredible. If you know me, you know how much I love Aussie bowls. They are like up there on the list of my favorite things ever. So I had cranberries, blueberries, bananas, pineapple, a bunch of other stuff on the Aussie bowl. When I got home, I had a very bizarre pre-workout snack. I went to go heat up this cauliflower in the microwave. It had like lemon juice on it and it was seasoned. It was great, but don't recommend eating that before you work out because it was not, <laughs> it was not good. But I was starving after the fact. So I went to go make dinner. I wanted to make uh, chicken alfredo with this alfredo sauce that had been sitting in the fridge for a while long story short um i opened it up and it had mold in it which was absolutely disgusting so i also had this chicken that is a really long clip for some reason um also i added zucchini i got this at target they have organic zucchini all the time at least at my target so if you want to find some go there anyways i found this all recipes recipe for alfredo sauce and i made that instead of using the moldy alfredo sauce because it was disgusting i also cooked the zucchini and i used chickpea pasta to make it a little healthier the alfredo sauce recipe called for cream cheese which was very interesting but it ended up tasting so good so here's the process i added in the chicken made sure it was all heated up after i strained the pasta and the sauce was not hard to make at all i was a little worried i was not going to do it right but it was chef's kiss once again so i poured the zucchini in after i kind of grilled that i would say and the best part was pouring the sauce on and stirring that all in you'll see in the next clips it doesn't even do it justice i was so proud of this because it took me a while to make but it was so divine I recommend. I'll leave the recipe for the sauce in the description box. The next morning, I made scrambled eggs for breakfast, and I also had this pumpkin muffin. My mom had made pumpkin chocolate chip muffins the night before. The edges were a little burnt, but I had this huge apple as well, and that was my breakfast. Of course, I didn't have my camera with me when I ate lunch, but I did take this photo of my Chick-fil-A bowl. I'm sorry, I meant to say Chipotle, not Chick-fil-A. It's been a very long day. It's currently 12.43, so I need to wrap up editing this. Well, I got corn, pico de gallo, lettuce, cheese, and a mix of carnitas and chicken with white rice. I also had a bunch of candy corn. I just took this selfie of me eating it at Grace's house so I could remember. And then me and Grace, after we went to my school's volleyball game, went to In-N-Out. And I just had this clip of Grace in In-N-Out eating a fry, but I had a burger and ice cream. And that's it. That's all for today's video. Okay, I just looked through my footage. I don't know if I recorded anything on Friday, so my apologies about that. It was so busy last week. Anyways, I need to wrap this up. Stay tuned for lots of videos this week. I have a Q&A coming on Thursday and then vlogs on Sunday. So until then, have a great week and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.